Hi, I'm Brian Hamilton, head football coach at Foothill High School in Palisadero, California. And I want to introduce you to the play that's become the cornerstone of the shotgun zone fly offense. And that is the fly sweep and the way we run it and implement it out of the shotgun. I want to spend the next couple moments talking about how the sweep has evolved in the shotgun zone fly offense. About three years ago, before installing this particular style of offense, we ran the traditional fly sweep. And basically, it was a two-back set with a sweeper. And a receiver was our fly sweep player. And his job was to attack flat down towards the quarterback, get the ball, and be a sweep threat on every play, whether he's getting the ball or whether he was a fake faking the ball or faking carrying the ball and so that the backs could run their inside run game. That worked very well for us, but as a coach, what I wanted to be able to do was spread the field more. And I wanted to incorporate the quarterback in the running game. So what we've done to this fly sweep is we have taken the quarterback, Foothill High School, and moved him back into a shotgun. We have gone to a single back set, and I'll explain that why in a minute. And we've moved our fullback out into a wing in most formations. Now let's talk about that for a minute. Why have we moved the wing out to the edge? Well, in traditional fly, move him back, in a traditional fly sweat, set, the sweeper moving down the line of scrimmage and getting the ball, the lead blocker for him on the perimeter was this back. Well, defense, has got, defense got pretty wise to that, and the outside force player would time this and actually come charging across the line of scrimmage to make contact on our side of the ball or two yards in the backfield. This causes problems with the sweep. Um, it disrupts the flow and it causes, uh, obviously, causes the sweep to turn up inside or to go really wide and we wanted to avoid that. So in the shotgun zone fly, what we've done is we have moved the quarterback back into a shotgun set. We have moved the halfback over the guard and we have now moved the fullback, which we call our wing, out to the edge in most formations. This has given us tremendous advantage. One is it stopped the force player from being able to disrupt that sweep and also it has allowed the sweeper to gain depth getting the ball at a deeper place so that he can read his blocks. In the traditional fly he would have to get the handoff at quarterback depth almost at the line of scrimmage and then slide back. But by being in shotgun, we've now allowed the fly sweeper to get the ball, get the handoff at depth, allowing him to easily read his perimeter block. For us, this has changed the sweep for us. It has made it more effective. At Foothill High School, we average over 10 yards of carry on the sweep. And as importantly as that, it has really opened up our inside run game. Because defenses now have to commit a certain amount of defenders, whether it be the force, the corner, a safety forcing, an inside backer scraping over. They have to commit several players, defensive players, to the sweep whether he's getting the ball or not. And by keeping our quarterback in the shotgun and by keeping a halfback um, in a shotgun alignment that's in more of an eye, almost as if in the pistol, um,